Skyroar is a small uh, rocket launch uh, company. Um, we're based in Edinburgh in the United Kingdom. Um, our ambition is, well, our tagline is from Scotland to space. Uh, we are looking to um, serve in the first instance the small sat market that we have in the UK. And we're kind of really lucky in that respect because um, there are a number of companies in, uh, in the central belt in Scotland, in Glasgow, Aspire, Clyde Space, Alba Orbital, um, not to mention the rest of the satellite clusters that we have down south. So we have a, a good opportunity to serve a large number of these uh, organizations um, immediately on our doorstep. So that's, I suppose, the, the biggest motivation we have uh, to trying to be the first or one of the first sovereign launchers from the UK. As a small launcher, yes, we're, we have, I suppose, a big ambition both to, to build the business around us because there's very little of the value chain that we have in the country. Uh, that said, there are a large number of companies in the ether, as it were, who can help us uh, champion some of the, the concepts that we have. Uh, we've 3D printed our engines. We verified one of the uh, 3D printed engines in uh, Cornwall uh, at the end of July, uh, which is the first, it was the, the, the first engine test that we did um, in the UK. It was a, a three and a half kilonewton engine, um, and we tested it in the, in the Haz in Cornwall, the Harden Aircraft Shelter, where the Bloodhound engine was being tested. Um, yes, and we have been um, printing, I suppose, our next ma main orbital vehicle engine. Um, um, in, in the first instance, we're using it for our suborbital vehicle, and it'll be pressure-fed, which means it, it makes it a, a 30 kilonewton engine. This engine will then be adapted and have a turbo punt attached to it for the main orbital vehicle, uh, which is our, our I suppose, go-to-market vehicle, commercial vehicle, which we hope to launch as soon as the regulations are ready in 2022. So, so yeah, there are plenty of innovations, I suppose, that we are um, starting in-house, including the 3D printed engines. We're also, um, I don't know whether you can call it innovative or not, but I suppose it is. We are um, spinning our own fuel tanks um, because, again, when we went to market looking for the best option available for fuel tanks for these vehicles, um, we discovered that we thought the best thing to do would actually invest in ourselves in the first instance to understand the cost elements and then to develop commercial partnerships going out. So, yeah, there are opportunities for spin-offs, I suppose, in our industry. So, yeah. So with every trade show, it's important to, uh, to, to be seen. It's also important. Um, we, we're very much like to feel ourselves part of the value chain, part of the network, part of the market. As I said, the regulations haven't been written, so the market's not finalized yet, but we are, we do a lot of collaboration, I suppose, with our partners, as I mentioned already, some of the small sat companies, with the rideshare companies who are developing at the moment. Uh, we're, we're helping understand where they fit, where their place is in the market alongside us. Um, uh, we believe that actually, one of the, the, the most sustainable way forward is, is through collaboration to help us create the, the legislation that's required to support the entire market. Um, and that includes, in the first instance for the United Kingdom, it's the legislation around small launch. So we are the, I suppose you could say, the commercial excuse to help the regulator write those rules. But we're doing it not just for ourselves, we're doing it for the whole market. So yeah, trade shows in that regard, I suppose, or as, uh, exhibitions such as Space Tech Expo are really useful because we have the chance to, it's both formal and informal discussions. Um, it's, the, you know, it's the combination of being able to sit and answer questions on a panel as well. Um, so yeah, it's, it's a really useful occasion to see as many players in the market at once uh, and to collaborate with them.